Bank dribble. She scored Schimmel right there. What a shot from How Faith Randolph. How about that from Faith Randolph? Virginia starting to get in control here. It is erased by Lauren the Moses. Freshman. Oh, my! They scores three left. The the Are you kidding me? One of the most remarkable individual efforts I have ever seen in basketball. Individual efforts, an apt description for the 2014-15 women's basketball team. While the Cavaliers enjoyed several great victories over conference rivals, the campaign lacked the collective success necessary to advance in the postseason. As her fifth year at Virginia begins, head coach Joanne Boyle hopes a renewed sense of focus, work ethic, and team unity will help guide UVA to the NCAA tournament and erase the inconsistency of seasons past. This group is very committed to putting the team first. Their goal is to obviously make the NCAA tournament, and so they're, they've been fighting really for it since May of last, last year when we finished what we would call a disappointing season. They just really made a commitment. We changed some things uh, with our conditioning program, and we came into this season in much better shape. We really, really did a lot of work on just team, and we had a lot of talk about being selfless and about just moving the team forward. You know, if we move the team forward, all individuals will shine. That's what it's about. And I think they've really committed to that. And they've committed to their training. They've committed to really working on their game on the off season. And so what I've seen in the first couple of days is, is the, the, the fruit of all that. Oh, I love the energy everyone's bringing and just the vibe that we have. And I think uh, all, everyone on this team is just really ready to bring it. And, improve from the season that we had last year. The first years want to come in and make their mark and then the returners just want to uh, leave the past behind and just keep keep going and stepping and moving in a new direction. Virginia hopes to travel in that new direction with pace, pushing tempo utilizing a group of five talented guards. Mason joins Faith Randolph and Michaela Venson in a backcourt that accounted for 55 percent of Virginia's scoring a year ago. Along with talented sophomore scorers Elia Hewlandell and transfer Jakira Brown, the team participated in a different off-season conditioning program to help shape its new identity. I think it starts with preparation. We've spent a lot of this summer just working on running, conditioning, being able to translate the off-court conditioning to on-court and being able to make good, good decisions while we're playing fast. So I think that'll definitely help us this season and also just knowing when to have a good balance, you know, using your basketball IQ to know like when we can get things going and run up and down and when it's better for us to slow down and run some more half court sets. Get better as you go on. Raise the ball. Raise the ball, Faith. Every day I want to help set the tone of how practices run. Just being aggressive every single possession. Really being nitty and gritty every single possession. I think that will really go into our identity as um, being transition, getting in, in transition, really being scrappy on defense and boxing out and rebounding, finishing plays. We're really holding each other accountable and really it's made us become more of a family. We want to fight for one another and we've seen how hard we have to work to get to that where we want to be. So whether it be, like I said, a little thing, getting up extra shots or um, working with the coach on defense, just doing the little things has really helped us and holding each other accountable. We just really talked about having an identity and that was we were going to be a running team and because now we have a group of bigs that have come in and we have Lauren and Sid that had experience but now we bring three post players in with some size, some length, some athleticism, well, we filled a need there so that, that's part of it. But we sat down and we said we want to be better conditioned, we want to be able to run more, we want to play more physical. And so we just really committed to, as a staff, saying this is what we're going to do, talk to our strength coaches, they were on board and we just kind of did some different things to get us ready for, for this year. We have five guards that can really play. And so we can push tempo. We're healthy. We have some people that are just new to the team and, and some veterans that have really meshed really well. We're just a year older, and especially at the point guard spot. Michaela was a freshman first year last year. Bree was only a second year, so we're more experienced there. I, think, I, I just think the upperclassmen have come in with a different mindset. While the Cavaliers' depth is a strength, the lone senior on the squad may be its most important asset. In her final season, leading scorer Faith Randolph knows where the team has been, and she wants to help determine the Cavaliers' destination in 2016. I just love the way she plays because she makes everyone else better, and we see that she's working hard, and that makes us just want to step up our game. We've been through just some ups and downs and some inconsistency, and she's just really kind of stayed the course and understands like good things are coming, and I just really appreciate about that. Like she. In adversity, she, she's fighting through that and understands that the growth is, is there and she sees it. And, and my hope for her is that she sees it all come to fruition this year. 
from my first year to my fourth year. I just want to show that you know I've grown every single year. This coming up year, I just want to put it all out there on the floor. We're just hungry, hungry for wins, hungry for getting stops on defense, just executing, and I think that's going to be really good for us. Have a better one tomorrow. Better one tomorrow. Okay? Go, ladies. Family on three. One, two, three. Family. Family.